Hi folks, how's it going? It's Ivan Five Zero Three. How are you doing? I'd like to go ahead and tell you a few things of information. I'll make it very quick and very easy to digest. My name is Celeste Mishra. I'm a real person, of course. You know, people don't usually dress up like this. And uh, a lot of people have asked me um, why I make videos from here. I'm very hard to fake them. No kidding. I always have a reason. I always have a method. Uh, make sure to look up John Masters and uh, Heinz, Travis Heinz. It's a good idea. A lot of us are out there, and uh, we're not crazy kooks or anything like that. Well, we try not to be. But there's something you guys need to know. For the last month or so, okay, we've been looking around at a few things that don't make sense. Number one, the layoff of hospital workers. How can you have hospital workers when you have all this danger and people who need to be taken care of and now you understand a little bit um, as was absolutely debunked here we had footage from an Italy hospital that was being shown on main, most mainstream media channels of what was going on right but the, the thing is is that that, that footage was from Italy and it wasn't from New York City. In fact, we've had people on the ground look at these hospitals and the interesting thing is is that there's no one there. These huge lines and everything else that they were talking about, like in Hawaii folks for God's sakes, there is no one at that hospital. Okay? Not a person. I mean not 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 that huge line, not what was taped, like that shit was manufactured. No joke. And I know you're probably like, dude, tinfoil hat, bro. You know, <coughs> if I was Mr. Tinfoil Hat, hmm, I don't think I'd even be bothering, would I? No. In fact, the only thing I really care about is the truth. So it seems that as of now, folks, every time you turn on your television or watch a YouTube video about it or have a post shared by somebody, if you don't know that person, like, you don't know them, okay, they haven't been there from the very beginning, you don't know these people, then I would be very weary of listening to them. I mean that. You folks need to understand that right now. You should be verifying this information, whatever they, you know, push out, because that's what happened in New York. And even though they were caught lying, it was just brushed under the thing, like no one cares. The other thing is, is that the hospitals, especially them making videos of them being overstacked and everything like that, that's simply not true. And that's not just true for the United States. That's true for parts of Europe. Okay. That's scary. That is really scary. The big problem here is, unfortunately, <laughs> I don't know what they're doing, but it sure doesn't seem like what they're supposed to be. Folks, if they're telling you to stay inside and they're, they're not actually willing to do coronavirus testing, I would be kind of worried about this because it seems kind of odd, right? Um... I think there's something else going on. And I think one of the reasons why they close down a lot of the schools is because they have laboratories. And laboratories, they were able to go ahead and do laboratory tests. And laboratory tests would... They'd be able to tell you whether there's a coronavirus outbreak. Yeah. Um, besides, folks, here's something to realize. Um, if the hospitals are empty in New York City. Why did all of Oregon's, like, our governor just sent out the masks and didn't tell anybody until their governor let everyone know about it? Um, <clears throat> that's kind of weird, don't you think? Here's another thing. 
there have been reports uh, for like visual all the stuff that these hospitals there's no lines there these kinds of things and a lot of people that like conservative news outlets that we trust because their news outlets haven't been reporting on it I mean that's pretty big don't you think I think so no, I haven't checked out InfoWars reports yet. But, like I said, I work with some very, very trusted people. People that I trust. Bar none. How much? Well, folks, we don't really have much to live for. No kidding. People put a gun under our head, we're like, go ahead. At least we're out of here. That's pretty much who we are. And... Not really a lot of reward in that, you know what I'm saying? There isn't. But I'm telling you folks, there's something going on. And it is not uh, what you think it is. I'm just going to leave it at that. Because again, unless I see it with my own eyes, I can't tell you now, can I? No. And that's the problem. I want to go ahead and let you know that, again, I am real. I am here. And what I mean by real is that I'm not being, like, manipulated. There's no person behind me with a gun or anything else like that. None of that bullshit. Um, And this video isn't, like, manufactured or anything. In fact, uh, make sure you guys know that there is, like, a background back there and all this other stuff. Current time... That's the current time right now. People wonder why I have all these moving displays. There's a very good reason for it. it makes it very hard for somebody to go ahead and uh, manipulate a video without leaving a shit ton of artifacts. You'd have to do quite a bit of jerry-rigging and angering to get that thing going. Anyway, folks, I hope you guys uh, are doing well. Um, actually, I can almost guarantee it. And... I would also kind of wonder, you know those stories that we've been hearing about people dying and so forth? Yeah, they're probably mostly true, but you know what's really odd? Folks, be honest with yourselves. Two people go to a hospital, supposedly they get infected, a man and a woman. Both of them die six minutes apart. The likelihood of that happening is very slim. And these people, whoever they are, (laughs) yeah. I'd be very careful about the information that you get. I'm just saying. Something's not right here. Sam Mickey 503. My real name is Lesh Mishra. And I hope you guys are doing well. And protect yourself at all costs. And I would go ahead and mention something to you. You know how they tell you, do the opposite of what they tell you to do? Why are, why is it there's a certain group that's able to pretty much do what they want and others can't? Just want to let that food for thought. Just something you should think about. Okay. Um... Would I be panicked right now? No. No. In fact, it's pretty much worthless to be. And am I going to tell you that you should go ahead and go expose yourself and do whatever? No. Because, see, that's the interesting part. Um... You know, I, 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 I don't have facts and figures in front of me. But, uh, yeah. Good luck, folks. Bye.